Hey guys, um, so today I wanted to do a video about something different. I wanted to do a video about getting bullied and things like that. Um, I heard about Amanda Todd. It is so sad that someone can make fun of someone and bully them and cyber bully and it's just amazing to me how fast it grows and grows and grows and none of y'all can ask an adult for help. I'm not judging you or anything and I'm not trying to be mean. It's just I think bullying is wrong and I'm trying my very hardest to prevent this from happening anymore because next month would have been Amanda Todd's 16th birthday her sweet 16 and some idiots out in the world made fun of her and cyber bullied her to the point of killing herself I mean Joey Gracefa, his um, YouTube username is Joey G R A C E F F A. <clears throat> Two F's and an A. And I liked his page on Facebook. <coughs> Sorry. And it said that Amanda Todd died Wednesday. And it broke my heart because she was just an innocent teenager. And five people had to make fun of her and cyber bullied her. I don't know what this world is today. I really don't. God... Yes, I'm a Christian. God needs to help us with this bullying crap. I know what it's like to be bullied. Yeah, you look at me and you're like saying, I don't think she's ever been bullied. But yeah. I have. I've, I was bullied at the age of seven. Um, I went to this one church in North Augusta. It's called Ridgeview Baptist Church. And um, there's these twins. And their names were Brianna and Santana. Almost like Montana, except for Santana. And, um, they had this big, long bush in their playground area. It was behind the church. And, um, I was behind the bush. And both of them came on each side of the bush blocking me and the only way I could get out is if I went forward because there's a way you could get out if you went forward and so before I went forward they were hitting me on the face they were flicking my ears they were flicking my body they were <coughs> sorry they were calling me names and they're like saying you're lazy and you're stupid and you're ugly and you're fat and they just kept making fun of me and I'm like saying I'm sick of this because I would always cry I would go to my sister and I would cry and I told her I said these two twins are being mean and they're making fun of me 
and she told him to quit. It didn't make no, it didn't make it much better. It made it worse. She told him again after I'd been bullied again, and they, it got worse and worse. So I had to tell an adult, their grandmother, and my pastor. I felt like I did the right thing. And for you guys to be bullied, and if you go to someone for help, don't go to your friends because it will just make it worse. You need to go to your teacher, your parents, your Sunday school teacher if you go to church. And most importantly, ask God to help you get out of these situations. Even if you're not a believer, you still need to ask God to help you. Because God is the only person who can help. And a, an adult. Those are the two main persons that can help you. <clears throat> yeah, I know what it's like to be bullied. It's not fun. It hurts. And it's painful. And, um... If you're the abuse... Like, if you get abuse from a bully... Yeah, sure, you can cover up the bruises and the scars... But you can't cover up the pain. The pain that builds up inside you. And you keep it bottled in. And not say anything. Now sometimes. It's hard. It's hard. But you can do it. I'm sorry if that didn't make any sense right there. But. And. If your parents, or your teacher, or an adult, or your pastor, or your friend can't help you, you need to stand up for yourself, and you need to fight back, or get a bodyguard, you know, because when I read about Amanda Todd, I wanted to cry. I really did. She was just an innocent teenager. An innocent teenager. Who needed help of getting out of bully. Bulliedness. Yeah, yeah. And so. Every day. I have been putting on my Facebook. Let's stop hate. Let's stop bullying. Bully. Bullying. Bullying. Yeah. I get it mixed up a lot. <clears throat> but. Every day on Facebook I've been putting. Let's stop hate. Let's stop bullying. And let's. Let's do this together. Rest in peace Amanda Todd. And. I even made a Facebook page, a light page, about bullying. It's called Let's Stop Together. I mean, not Let's Stop Together. Let's Stop Bullying Together. And the picture is red and white, and it says, <clears throat> Stop Bullying. Bullying. Stand up and speak out. That's the picture. It would mean so, so much to me if you could go and like it. I'm trying to get a million, a hundred thousand likes on that. Because, one, I'm standing up for what's right. Two, I believe that this needs to stop. And three... 
you can't cover up the pain. So, I want you guys to think about it. And if you're a bully, then may God have then may God help you. Because you need to change. You need to stop bullying. You need to stop being so mean to innocent people. Even stop cyberbullying. It's wrong. So you think about that. Yeah, you. But that's all I wanted to say and it would mean a lot to me if you could go like that page. Remember, the picture is stop bullying and it's red and white and it says stand up and speak out. Or speak out and stand up. It's either way. <coughs> but yeah. And yep. For those who are bullied every day, I will be praying for you. And if you want God to help you, this is all you gotta do. I'm going to demonstrate on how to pray. Okay? If you need help, just say, Dear Lord, I am sick of being bullied and no one is there to help me. I feel like I'm all alone. And say, Lord, can you help me? Can you help these bullies back off? And in a couple of days, it should help. But you should leave me alone. But you need to pray to God every day. Okay? So, I love you guys. And shout out to my subscribers. Pink Sparkle. Crazy Ray Ray. Um, Miss Glamour. Miss Glam. Glams or <laughs> Ingrid. Miss Glams or I can't. I'll put her in the description box. Luke Conard. And Joey Grace So that is it. And yeah. Thanks. Bye guys.